This is James Holder for IFL TV. I'm at the Press Conference State in Chigwell. Just bumped into Joel McIntyre ahead of his Southern Area Title Challenge. How are you doing, Joel? Yeah, very well. And yourself, yeah? Very well indeed. Yeah, good, very good, well good. Good. Miles Shinkman, in the way of you becoming Southern Area Champion, how much do you know about Miles? Uh, I know that he's in the way of me becoming Southern Area Champion. <laughs> um, yeah, no, tidy boxer, I've been told, you know, at this level I should hope I should hope so as well. Um, yeah, it's just, I've got one thing in mind and that's winning that title. It's the first step, the first serious step. I don't know what else, that's it, that's it. That's all I'm focused on, 100% winning that title. It's good that's to it. see two unbeaten fighters putting it all on the line at Southern Area level, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. I said I can't remember the last time this really happened. It's, um, yeah, two unbeaten fighters, you know, it's, 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 a, it's a serious fight, it's a proper fight. That's what I got in this game for in the first place, to be completely honest with you. It's the, it's the hurt game, it's the fighting game, it's, you know, it's one of them things. And, uh, you know, a fight that's a fighter and an opponent that's coming to, coming to do as much damage to me as I was hoping to do to him, just makes for a, makes for a definite good fight. Are you anticipating a lot of support from Portsmouth at your call coming down, getting involved with the Conte Yeah, yeah, I am. Yeah, I am. I, I've got a lot of support down there. Um, everyone's interested, you know, in, in a, they like to support a local lad. I mean, and um, I think a lot of people see see good things in me, and um, I appreciate it. Uh, there's too many to mention right now, you know. <laughs> um, but yeah, I've got a, spon a sponsor to look after me. Everyone, a lot of people, close close knit people, look after me, and. Um, yeah, I appreciate it. Um, also got support from like the the charities, uh, Big World Impact that I'm involved with, and yeah. also um, Amelia May Foundation. I just like to drop their names there because I am involved with them. They're kind of obviously non-profit, they're charities, and and I'm, I just wanted to put out there. How helpful is Johnny Ames and the lads at the Trad TKO? Sorry. How helpful is Johnny Ames and the lads at the Trad TKO? Ah, oh, brilliant, brilliant. It's like it's a real hub in it. You know that that gym is serious. Like Johnny's my manager now. He was he began as my trainer. Got a new trainer now, at Ari Andrews. All right, Ari. Um, James, your boy. All good. <laughs> mate, I'm good. He's friends with everybody. He everybody him likes him. Yeah. Yeah. He's um. He might. Ah, uh, no. I won't mention anything about the ladies or anything. We get me in trouble. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> But uh, yeah, no, it's, it's really teaching me a lot. I've learned so much, you know, in, in recent weeks and months now. And um, yeah, it's just reignited my love for it, to be honest. Reignited my love for the sport. Um, I was getting a little bit stagnant. I was fighting, uh, and they were serious. They were good fights, you know, no disrespect to the opponents, but this is what it's all about. This is what it's all about. Oh, well, listen, Joel, I wish you the best in that with your fight. I hope you and Miles both come out safe. Thank you for giving me a bit of time for the man. I much appreciate it. Nice one. Thanks very much. Cheers, Harry. We're well done. Thanks, Shane.